All right, first of all, I can't believe how much hair I had 30 years ago. But that aside, George Barber is a treasure. I feel like I stand on his shoulders every day when I'm at KDKA Radio. I thank him for that. I thank his daughter for preserving that show because that's history. That's not just George Barber history. That is our history. KDKA Radio is celebrating its 100th anniversary this year. George Barber is a big part of that history. So again, we are we are we're doing this social distancing thing. I don't know what's going to be on next week's show, but over the next couple of weeks, we're going to be going into the vaults of the Lynn Hayes Freeland show. I am thrilled that we were able to start it off with George Barber. I just think that uh, we need to celebrate people like George when we look at journalism, we look at media, we look at civil rights. He is a big part of it. And by the way, George Barber is alive and well. He lives in this area, and I thank him for the doors that he opened up for all of us. I thank him for the history that he shared with all of us. I thank him for the opportunities that he has given all of us. I thank him. George, thank you so much. We'll see you next week.